What's up, boss? I see you pulled up on this deck review channel, baby. I am Niami Shalee. I am a tarot reader and a spiritual teacher. I also study planetary alignment and tarot decks so I can let you know what that deck do. I am going to clear the energies right now really quickly. Um, I hope you're having an amazing day. I am using salt. I don't know um, if you know, so I'll just share with you. Sea salt clears the energies by um, adding a flame. It like zaps all the negative energies out of the room. I'm telling you, it's almost faster than Palo Santo. So I'm just sharing, you know one of my um, practices with you as I do always using a little Florida water and what's in my cup you ask what's in my cup today I usually tell you guys what's in my cup and the cup is a coconut today yes the cup is a coconut today coconut water is amazing it is a source of H3O, and it's amazing with hydration, full of electrolytes, um, helps with acne. It is It works wonders for acne-prone skin. Um, I do have a, a ritual that I do with my coconut for manifesting, so if you would like to know it, uh, you can follow me on TikTok. I have some stuff over there. Um, I will link everything in the description box for you. Well, today we're working with the wisdom of the Oracle. Now, when I first started out as a tarot reader, I had issues with when I first started out before I even got my first deck. Um, I had an issue with pricing of decks. Um, I was kind of low on budget and I just went straight to Amazon, tried to figure out how I can get an inexpensive deck. Um, I heard that your first deck should be gifted to you. So I was like, well, I don't want to spend a lot of money on this very first deck. And I didn't. I spent about $10. Second deck, third deck, fifth deck. I went a little bit deeper. I was in love with Oracle um, and because it always gave a nice message at the end of something that may be harsh because tarot can be harsh there is no bad card in tarot but the message that's coming off the advice that is to be given sometimes can come off harsh so i like the oracle as something to give as a uh, hope so to speak uh so once i started purchasing on amazon and you're not actually vis visibly seeing this thing face to face i started to receive fake decks okay so it was it was a love hate thing for me it was bittersweet for me because i didn't want to come off like i wanted a fake deck um but then i got i came to grips with what it was sometimes you get that counterfeit deck and it's amazing um sometimes you get that deck that it's not so good and you don't want to buy the real one so i just started to embrace the fact that sometimes when i purchase decks off amazon and i wasn't actually getting the face-to-face -face feel of the deck or card um now i understand what's fake and what's real so i intentionally purchased this deck um it is runs about seven dollars and this is the wisdom of the oracle i am not held up in any regard about who who wrote it who did it who did the artwork i'm not hung up on that anymore okay because they already got their money they already got their money they have people out there who are who have the money to purchase full price and then they have the people who are starting out who just love the artwork who just love the backs who love uh, tarot you can make there are um arguments that you 
you know, the divination thing. It's no longer divine because it's copied. Um, this is the back of this particular um, oracle. And it is the wisdom of the oracle. And I'm sure you've seen this before. Um, I fell in love with the back. Okay, and when I went out there to actually get the deck, I could not find it anywhere. Okay, so when I saw this for about seven dollars on on YouTube, uh, sorry, on Amazon, I decided to pick it up. Well, it is very small. Okay, one thing I actually like, love, just it makes me giddy is to make a double deck okay so um i am not um pressed for um decks anymore but because i do not have a red deck that speaks to me i do have one red deck and this is the erotic deck and the sexual erotic tarot um but it's just a tarot deck. Um, and I don't, I don't, I'm not really, I don't really feel the artistry in this deck. So I don't use it very often. I did not connect with the deck, so to speak. So I wanted something positive and something that I connected with, which is Oracle. Um, it comes in this flip box like this. Um, if you have a problem with, this is um, by Colette Baron reed I don't know if it's no longer being printed or because I know there is some stuff from her that's no longer being printed. And, you know, some people will say, well, if it's no longer being printed, I don't want it. Uh, that's not me. OK, I have no qualms about it. So you see what I just did. I took both of those decks out and I have made now for 14 around 14 dollars. I have made a nice size tarot deck or Oracle deck um and it actually uh the benefits i love of a double oracle or double tarot which i do have several i have my double deck and there is a video down below um on my page rather um that shows how to do this is a double major so it is a one full tarot deck and then only major and court cards and aces are doubled in this deck. This is double deck. If it spins out, this is actually my second double deck. If it spins out, I'll just go get two more of these smaller um, decks and I will put them together. I will take out. So with those extra cards that I have, I'll send those in, in my orders. I sell um, candles, cleansing sprays, intention oil and fixed candles so i'll put my extra cards you know i'll take one and sign it and put it in that package uh for the extra cards that i end up not having i also have um another double deck hold on one second i got lots of stuff going on over here so i'm glad that you're here with me today um here is another, this is, um, and so I'm basically speaking of my decks that I purchased that were fake, okay, that was counterfeit, um, that I would go in and I'll be like, oh my goodness, that deck is $10? Well, no, it's a counterfeit, and what actually ended up happening with this deck, I love the backs of the decks, so I really, really wanted it, this is the full size of it so there's this smaller version and there's this is the real one um i named my tarot decks did i tell y'all i named my tarot decks yeah this is um luna and this is mooney um and so i just made this one into a double deck because i didn't so when i first got it let's say it was like this size and so you already know like when you see somebody shuffling a deck that's like this size you like what what the heck and it's actually 78 cards so this one is at one of my double decks that i use as a clarifier with the real deck love the artistry on that one i'll show it to you um a little you know in another video i'll show you those two decks but i was just showing how 
I took counterfeits and I made double decks out of them. And the one amazing thing about a double deck is that if you get that card twice, honey, you know that that message is for that person. Now, the one thing with this is that it doesn't come with a book, but you can download it. There is a, um, a QR code on the back of that box and you can download the book, but I'm not really into books. So what I'm doing or what I will do with this deck is when the cards come out, I will use my intuition and I encourage everyone to use their intuition, especially when you're reading for someone. Okay, so I'm going to see how this shuffles. The cards are fairly thin, um, but it's okay because you don't even really need to shuffle Oracle like that as if the way I shuffle um, regular cards. I do want to get a nice clean shuffle from this and bridge i bridge my cards i don't care how much they cost i bridge my cards i don't i do not care there are lots of people you should respect the deck you should and i you'll probably hear me say that because i'm reviewing a deck but i i don't i don't care how much the deck costs it's it's getting dealt with okay i'm going to use my real energy my real spirit um one of the ways that i cleanse I'm going to, I don't necessarily cleanse tarot decks, I mean, uh, oracle decks, because what's the need? You know, it, it's, it usually has very clean energy anyway, um, as far as the messages that it is going to bring for you. But in one of the ways that I cleanse my decks is using sound. Okay. I also use flame, but it went out. So I'm going to just cleanse really, really quickly. And let's see how it, well, I know how it shuffled. Let's see how it flipped, all right? I love getting a flipper card. I love getting a flipper. Let's see, all right? Go the distance. Oh, I got two. Okay, good. Go the distance. There's the artistry on that card. They have numbers that, comes up to 11 breaks down to 11 go the distance um intuitively what i get from that is and, and this is a this is maybe just an issue for me <laughs> um i start something and i may not finish it all the time um i have and that's something that i'm currently working on is giving up too quickly if I'm not seeing results, but now I understand that I, that is operating in your masculine because the masculine is always looking for results. So, um, as a way to usher in my divine feminine, I've decided to go the distance because there's all, there is always the potential of something grandiose at the end. Um, we also have clean it up, and that is, the number on there is 21, breaks down to three, which is, um, some say is the first number, three. <clears throat> Love that it says clean it up. Ooh, it's almost like it's speaking to me. I wasn't even trying to get a reading, but I'm nosy. Like, I'm nosy in the mud. <laughs> nosy in the mud. <laughs> I'm nosy. At this point, I'm nosy. Clean it up. Loyal heart. Okay. For someone, this is a message for someone who is actually watching. Um, it comes up to eight. It's 35 there. Breaks down to eight loving heart someone some of you are looking for someone 
um, needing reciprocity. Oh. And co-create. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Go the distance. You'll find your person on your path. Clean it up. What I get from clean it up is be very clear. Be very clear to divine. Loyal heart. Someone will come in and co-create. It's co-creating with the universe. Allowing divine to know your vision and see it. A lot of times we have a vision and we have our... um. We literally have our plan in place and it doesn't work out like that. Well, understand Divine wants to co-create with you. You tell the story to Divine and it happens. That's how it goes. Um, I'm going to show you a little bit more. I was really more of showing you how to create a double deck from a counterfeit deck or from a small deck that does not um, serve you. I like a lot of cards. I'm sorry. Um, it's perfect for my hand size. Um, I'm going to show you a, a couple more of the uh, cards. Like As I said, you can actually download this uh, book for the official meanings of these cards or what it's showing or whatever. But this is like orphaned. This is orphaned. So it has a number. It has a picture and it has the writing at the bottom. This is Treasured Island. So for people who are into books, this may not work for you, um, but I am not. New Life. The Tribe. Poised, the fates, we already saw go to distance, peace, soulmates, breathe, So, yeah, I, I'm i going to go through here and see some stuff that I actually like. Deep knowing. Ooh. Flexible. Observer. Ooh, somebody is watching. I just got that. Somebody is watching. Never ending story. This is when you're going through that cycle and you want that circle, that hamster wheel, and you just want it to stop. Well, if you want it to stop, you have to do something different. Chop wood. And so what I'm thinking that I might do, I'm thinking that I might just go ahead and download it, get a couple, like um, this one is to the sea. So um, I would want to know what that means. So I might go ahead and download the book. What ends up happening for me is there may be one or two that I don't understand. And that was even when I learned tarot. When I learned tarot, there was about four or five that I didn't get and I studied them. Um, I did not study the whole deck. I did, did not memorize pictures. Um, I knew the meanings. I could tell by the meanings and I read more intuitively than anything. Um, I do have my own particular meanings. I do not read like everybody else. Um, so, ooh, we have thinker here. All right, so, oh, this is, oh, I love this one. Between worlds. All right, so one of the things that I wanted to know when I first got decks was how did it shuffle and what the backs look like. I was like, hurry up, show the back. So I hope I uh, gave you what you wanted, um, like I said nice shuffle paper uh cardstock kind of thing but you really don't need all of that um when you're when you're doing an oracle you don't really need that shuffle 
um, I see people who do whole readings with an oracle card. Um, and I think it's amazing. I don't do that. I haven't done that. Um, I might. I don't know. Um, I had to, I felt away the first time I saw it. So I had to kind of check myself on that because everybody reads whatever they want to read. That's something, you know, um, This in, these energies right now for 2023 is about the others. And this is about not worrying about others. This is about allowing others to be who they are in their own skin, allow them to walk their path and live their life. Uh, so a lot of times what we do in society is we worry about what other people do and then we we speak on it, we judge on it or whatever. So yeah, um, I have seen people do whole readings with their Oracle decks. Like I said, I like double decks because if I get a double message spirit, it's divine is literally saying double down on that, um, on that message. I do actually have another deck that I doubled, but it is a plan card deck. And I will show you guys more on this um, in one of my uh, my next videos. So be on the lookout for that. I actually had someone mention my purple deck in the comments. I had someone mention, I showed a purple deck um, in, the, in one of my other videos. And I had someone mention this deck and I am just um, speaking to her about it they are out of stock this it, it it literally came with everything like it came with this satchel this little um tarot bag it's velvet and it's satin on the inside so it has the past present future it has the love readings the you them and then the relationship um the mind the body the spirit path one path two path three accept embrace and let go uh, I love that. I have never used this, but I promise I will. This particular deck is sold out, though. I got it off Amazon, and I promise if I ever see it again, I will let you know. But it is with the purple sides, gilded edging. Um, I have used it. So when I say the edges are not, um, I've used it, okay? Um, it was only around, it was less than $20. Uh, I got this, someone purchased this for the channel, but when it com becomes available again on Amazon, I will let you know, because it, it is not, it is not like out with the, I, I don't know how I found it, but like, it does not come up like as one of the first tarot's or if you would have put purple tarot in that it would just come up. So yeah, it, but it's all purple and it is a beginner's deck so it also gives like you know uh some information on the cards but if you love purple you don't care about it being that because you know how you read and you may not use those words that are on there i was just making reference to that person who commented i pay attention to all comments i love if it's something that you want to see, because I have a lot of tarot decks. I am over a hundred tarot decks right now. So if it is a deck that you personally want to see, let me know in the comments and I promise I'll get back to you. Just like I got back to this person about this deck. This deck, like I said, is out of stock, but as soon as it becomes available, I will go to that comment, personally take it upon my, myself and energy to tell you about this deck being restocked. Thank you so much for being here. I do this. Um, one of, oh, the one of the reasons why I like this one, I do not know what this deck is um, is saying, but I I enjoyed it because it has a circus theme. It has a circus theme, so that was one of the reasons why I enjoy um, the pictures. I was not unable to find this particular deck, um, the real version. So. I went with this and I love it. I love it. If you would like to purchase my crystal meditation candles, let me know. Let me know. These are full of crystals and they are to be used during meditation. So they all have different um, properties for them. That particular one is for uh, travel and courage. This is my bird of paradise. 
um, and it has carnelian, yellow citrite, and amethyst. Yeah, amethyst crystals in there. All right, it has been real. I'll be back. I will be back.